The Canary System Installer consists of three component groupings. The Historian Server, Data Collectors, and Client Tools. If you're following our best practices, data collection tools should be installed on a different machine than the Historian and other Canary tools. The Canary Data Collectors should be installed as close to the data source as possible. This likely means you will install the Canary Collectors, Canary Admin Service, and Sender Service on your OPC server, MQTT broker, or SCADA server. Additionally, the Canary Historian Server software components should be installed on their own standalone VM or physical server. The same installation program is used for all parts of the Canary system. Typically, different modules are installed based on the purpose of the server. These purposes usually are for data collection or data storage and contextualization or client tools for reporting. So in our first video, I want to focus on the process of installation on a data collection machine. Data collection from a data source involves the following components and is recommended to be done on a separate server or VM than the Canary Historian itself. So first you'll use the download link that you receive from a Canary representative to download the Canary installer. and you'll run the file with elevated privileges and then you'll select the system modules you desire to install and deselect modules not appropriate for the desired solution so for data collection you must install the canary admin service in the store and forward it's important to note that some components will not be able to be deselected since they are required based on other components that are currently selected so for example, the sender and the Canary Admin Service and Canary Admin Client are required for store and forward. Next, you should choose which of the Canary data collectors are appropriate for your use case and install them accordingly. So in our example, I would like to install the Canary OPC collector and the MQTT collector. Next, I'll select the Install button and complete the installation. When the status bar is solid green and the success message appears, the installation is complete. 